there was wild jubilation inside the country of Afghanistan as last weekend it became the first country in history to defeat the mighty Soviet Union. The retreat of Soviet military power from Afghanistan is complete. The last of Russia's regular army invasion force is out. Fear and uncertainty were mixed with joy today as the commander of Soviet troops followed the last of his men across the border. CBS News Moscow correspondent Barry Peterson begins our coverage. It was the last hurrah, the final Soviet combat troops crossing the Friendship Bridge on the border between Afghanistan and the Soviet Union. The Soviet commander, the Look what you did, Charlie. Hey, 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 hey. It's traditional to make a gesture towards the vanquished. Gus, it's your honor. Okay. Uh, well, here's to you, you motherfuckers. <laughs> the era of Soviet military intervention in other countries is now over. Well, I told you. Uh, told me what? All we had to do, shoot down the helicopters. Listen, not for nothing, but, but, but do you know the story about the Zen master and the little boy? Oh, is this some from Nitsa, the Greek witch of Aqualippa, Pennsylvania? Maybe? Yeah, as a matter of fact, it is. I was a little boy. On his 14th birthday, he gets a horse. And everybody in the village says, how wonderful, the boy got a horse. And the Zen master says, we'll see. Two years later, the boy falls off the horse, breaks his leg, and everybody in the village says, how terrible. And the Zen master says, we'll see. Then a war breaks out, and all the young men have to go off and fight, except the boy can't because his leg's all messed up. And everybody in the village says, how wonderful. And the Zen master says, we'll see. So you get it. No. No, no, because I'm stupid. You're not stupid. You're just in Congress. Send them money. You can start with the roads, move on to the schools, factories. Gus, now it's a party. Restock the sheep birds. Hey, give them jobs, I'm give trying. them hope. I'm trying. Yeah, we'll try I'm, harder. I'm fine for every dollar. Yeah, yeah. I took you from five million to a billion. I broke the ice on the sting in the Milan. I got a Democratic Congress in lockstep behind a Republican president. Oh, well, that's not good enough, because I'm going to hand you a code word classified NIE right now, and it's going to tell you that the crazies have started rolling into Kandahar like it's a fucking bathtub drain. Jesus, Gus, you could depress a bride on her wedding day. Hey. Listen to what I'm telling you. 